I tried Andrew Tate's The Real World and made over a hundred grand in a single month. Made so much money, in fact, that he posted a video of me on his personal Twitter account to his millions of followers. And in this very video, I'm gonna show you how you can do the exact same and make money yourself. And I'm also going to be reviewing Andrew Tate's course and really diving deep and telling you how much it helped me and if you yourself should invest. Now, before we get into the exact business model that I started, I first want to kind of paint a picture of the journey so you have the best idea of really how it all happened. Because when I joined Andrew Tate's course back in the beginning of February of 2022, I really had no idea, not what I was doing with business, but no idea what I was doing with life in general. I mean, I had a whole bunch of jobs. I was in the army, I was a security guard, and I was a carpenter just working cheap labor across all of those fields and still barely making enough money to actually get by. Fast forward almost exactly 24 months from that period. And like I said, I'm making over $100,000 every single month. And I've been able to do pretty much whatever I wanted. I mean, I have a whole bunch of cars, a whole car collection. I'm not Tate yet with 52 supercars, but I got the Corvette, I got the Camaro, I got the Audi RS5, and I got the Ram truck. So I have a little bit of a start so far. Now, when I say I make over $100,000 a month, I mean from my number one income stream. Now, I have around five or six income streams in total, ranging anywhere from you know coaching and info products and also some crypto as well on the side. But we're gonna get all into that that in a second. And I'm going to reveal to you the number one business model that I actually used to make my first 5k a month. And then of course, my first 10k a month. But of course, this all begs the question, how much did Andrew Tate's course, The Real World or Hustlers University 2, as it was called back then, actually play a part in my success? Now, I also want to make a very quick disclaimer that everything I'm about to say in this video is completely unbiased. I don't have any affiliate links. And although I like Mr. Andrew Tate, and of course, I'm grateful that he made Hustlers University because I might not actually be where I am today, I'm still going to tell my honest, objective truth about Hustlers University slash The Real World and how it actually isn't really that good and I personally don't recommend it. So in case you didn't know, Andrew Tate's The Real World is where you get to learn bang out machete, boom in her face, and grip her up by the neck. What's up, bitch? You also get access to over a dozen wealth creation methods. But don't be mistaken because honestly, a lot of these methods are pretty dookie. And we're gonna go through some of them and just let me explain why I think this. So, okay, let's start with uh, drop shipping in e-commerce. Probably one of the most popular ways to make money online right now. And that's because everybody who's doing it and everybody who claims to be an e-commerce dropshipper or whatever is talking about, well, hey man, I'm making like 300K every single month. When in reality, that 300K isn't actually profit, it's just revenue. Meaning that the part that they left out is that they spent $297,000 on ads or paid traffic. So really they only made 3K. And they also don't tell you how much stress they're under because they're trying to ship cheap Chinese products around the world. And they're also not actually ending up adding any value to the overall marketplace. Not to mention, this is really just not a great way to make money online for beginners because you have to set up a store and you have to also invest in the business before you actually start seeing any money come in. So unless you got a couple grand to invest right off the bat, then this is a big no. Even if you do have a couple grand to invest, I wouldn't risk it. Again, another example of a wealth creation method taught in the real world is crypto, but I don't really understand how beginners are going to invest in crypto when they ain't got no money to invest in crypto with. It's my philosophy that you shouldn't even really be investing in stocks or crypto until you're able to put maybe 50 grand, 100 grand in there. Otherwise, let's say you put $1,000 in crypto and you absolutely hit it big. You put your $1,000 into Doge Elon coin in a 10 X's, right? And now your $1,000 is 10 grand. But guess what? You're still actually poor. You're so again, is this business model actually worth learning? Well, not if you're broke, not if you have nothing. And again, there's other ones like day trading, for example. I mean, bro, you need money for most of these ways to actually build wealth. So I don't even understand why he would even put these in the program in the first place. Not to mention when it comes to day trading, you're gonna be risking your money. So there's no telling how many people actually lost money when they joined Hustlers University too, or the real world. They put five grand or 10 grand in a trading account and then they blew it all up. Out of all of the 
dozen or so business models that are taught inside of the real world. There's probably only a couple that are actually viable. And there's one that sticks out that I actually use myself to make my first 10 grand. And I didn't have to invest any money up front. And the business model that I actually started with was copywriting because it took zero dollars to start. And I really loved it because there was almost no luck involved. The worst part about like day trading and crypto is that you can make all the correct calculations and then still be wrong. The thing with copywriting is that you get to depend on yourself. And that is really what I wanted to do. I wanted to know that if I worked hard and if I really put my best effort forward, that I would get rewarded for that no matter what. And that's where copywriting comes in. Now, of course, if you don't know what copywriting is or you've never heard of it before, maybe you've heard of it, but again, you think it has to do with like copyright law or you're not really sure, you know, what exactly it entails. Essentially, it is just writing marketing pieces for businesses. So marketing emails, websites, sales pages, promos, this sort of thing. Now, yes, the real world did put me on to copywriting, which of course I am grateful for. But the fact of the matter is that most people end up leaving the real world in two to three months because that's really all the information that it has to offer only to complete beginners. It really doesn't have any advanced skills. And a lot of the times people just join, like I said, for a couple months and then they move on to something better, which again is exactly what I did. And this is because some of the teachings in the real world are not only just really basic because some of them are just downright bad. So for example, the outreach lessons that they taught us for copywriting were just downright terrible. I mean, they gave us one email template that we were all supposed to use all 100,000 of us or 200,000 or however many we're supposed to use to actually go ahead and get clients. And each and every single business owner was just getting bombarded by the exact same emails over and over and over again. So like I said, I get these five to 20 times a week, pretty much the exact same thing. Most of them are word for word until the point where business owners literally put an autoresponder on their Gmail saying that if anybody that they don't know emails them, then they want it to autorespond with, hey, if you're one of those dudes, right, those copywriting dudes who's going to magically make me money with your copywriting and you're from Huntsville University, please leave me alone. That is literally how serious it was and how many business owners were getting annoyed by all the and you tape people. And to be honest, that leads me to the other downsides of the real world. First and foremost, everybody inside there literally just wants to be Andrew Tate. It is essentially an Andrew Tate fan club. Everybody's copywriting just sounds like Andrew Tate. Everybody in there and all of their conversations really just sound like they're trying to be Andrew Tate. Not to mention pretty much every single thing that you learn inside of the real world can just be learned for free on YouTube. That's exactly why I dedicated like two years of building this channel just to give out free courses so that people can learn how to do copywriting and how to actually make money with it. And the funny thing is that there are so many comments on all of my videos about how this video, that course, or whatever free course that I did is 10 times better than the real world in the first place. And look, not only did copywriting actually get me to my first 10K a month, but it also got me to my first 100K a month, but just in a little bit of a different way. So. Remember, I told you guys I make $100,000 a month just with my top one income stream. And then with all my other income streams, they essentially vary from 2K a month to 8K a month. And of course, my largest income stream is actually my own info product. Now, I'm not scared to tell people that because I'm just being honest. And most online gurus would want to hide that from me, but really there's no shame in it. I mean, it's just essentially giving people education who choose to pay when in reality, hundreds of thousands of people already watch my YouTube videos and gain value and only a very small percent, maybe a thousand actually end up paying and getting in the communities. Does that mean you should go out and actually start your own info product business? Well, chances are probably not because you might not actually have a skill that you can monetize like that. And you don't want to just pull up a bunch of information from other people who are already doing it because then you just become that dude who's unqualified to actually speak about what he's trying to sell people on and you just look like a dork. Geeks, bro. But you can still make money from info products without having to build your own one, without having to even have a skill or without having to have an audience. And that is by, again, becoming a copywriter. Guys, when I'm telling you that copywriting is probably the biggest opportunity that's gonna come around right now, I'm not even joking because the online info product business is completely blowing up. I mean, we see hundreds of new creators every single day getting on platforms like school and making 10 and 50 and 100 and a million dollars every single month. Guys like Hamza, guys like Iman Gadji, and guys like Andrew Tate. And every single one of these businesses needs a copywriter slash marketer. And that could be you. And that is really what I'm grateful for joining the real world for because it put me onto what I really do consider the number one way to make money online today. So look, that is my 
overall opinion of the real world make sure if you've actually joined the real world before go down in the comments and let me know so that everybody watching this video can make the most informed decision on whether they want to get in and purchase or not and again if you guys want access to some free courses on how to get started with copywriting how to make some money and also how to get some clients all of that will be on screen right now as a full entire playlist all right everybody that's it for today and of course i'll see you guys on the next one peace